Hello everybody, I am Tom and you are watching me play XCOM Chimera Squad. In today's episode, we're going to take on the story mission to take down the progeny. Um, ordinarily what I've been doing is doing these missions until it forces me to do the main story mission, but because I have the team that I want for the story mission, I think I'm just going to go on it immediately. It just seems like the safer choice. Okay, so the progeny are constructing a device atop the tallest building in Old Town. They think they intend, uh, we think they intend to force a psionic evolution in humanity, but that theory is a crackpot at best. Stop them before they hurt a lot of people. Interesting. So they're going to try and turn everybody psionic. Huh. Progeny units have increased armor. That's unfortunate, but what you going to do? Um, fine, 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 fine. Let's go. I feel like she should have a Mastercrafted SMG. And I, in fact, I think she does have a Mastercrafted SMG. Because this is 3 to 5. Let's see how much it does in the mission. Because last time it was doing like 7. I think it now does 4 to 7. The it's just like a... Have withdrawn to the 60th floor, except for some stragglers ahead. Well, the elevators are out, so you'll have to take alternative transportation up top. If you say the water main, I'll strangle you. It's an anti-gravity sled, cobbled together by squatters during the occupation. Mildly exposed to the elements. Well, mild to moderate exposure. You'll be fine. Thanks. I, I feel the confidence. Okay, so... Watchtower. Units automatically enter Overwatch, and all units entering get 20, 20, 20, plus 25 aim. Um, and first impression. First unit through his entrance guaranteed to lend their shot. This is better. Do I want to waste... A flash bomb? I don't think I do. Breach! Breach! Alright, so everyone should have damn good aim currently. Uh, one aggressive... Okay, the Archon is aggressive. Don't know if I'm going to be able to take the Archon out, unfortunately. Hmm. Take the shot. Got the crit, fantastic. Phyllis advance on this one. Gets rid of the action. Take out the Acolyte. Yeah, see, it does 5 to 7. So I, I do have a Mastercrafted SMG, it's just not reading as such in the the actual thing. That's an odd bug. Um, sure, I'll take that. Shredding armor is worth it. Did three damage to somebody? I'm not entirely sure who. Uh, okay. Let's talk. Why would you run through fire then? That seems like bullshit. Something's going on here. I'm ready for him. That's a shitty bug, and I don't like it. Um... Like, can I put fire out with, like, preparation or something? I mean, Terminal can put it out for him, I suppose. It sucks that I have to waste my team up this early, and I really don't want to. But I think it's the best possible outcome. Eh. Gets cover, Blue Blood. Damn idiot. He just ran into fire! Burnout is fine. It's effectively a wasted turn, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. 
Hmm. Start the generator is what I have to do. I don't really know what to do here. I'm gonna take out these things because I think they're giving everyone extra health. Yep, they are. Fantastic. No longer an issue. Cool. That's it. You're I'll take done. it. Terminal. All right, I guess. Codex could be a problem. Get in here. I did not notice that Codex was on Overwatch. Luckily, she has lightning reflexes, so it doesn't matter. Uh, chain shot on this guy. Hmm, what's a regular shot do? Five to seven, take that. Irritating. Um, dangerous spot to be, but not too horrible. It's only 62% chance to hit, really? As opposed to 93. Take the 93. Forces is go. Interesting. Fucking blue blood. God damn, blue blood. Um Take that. Interesting. I'm going to do preparation. Removes burning. Okay. Fantastic. Does indeed remove burning. Ow. I have your number now. Prick. You can manage. I get four dudes in a row, that's useful. Great, I'm out. Go! Go now! Out of ammo. Punch him. That was a bad call. Talk is in a bad position here. Still in a bad position. Luckily, she can dodge. Don't play it down if it's bad. Splintering. Gonna split, but not much I can do about that. 
didn't split. Weapons dry. Safeguard. Don't want to waste second win yet. I'm out. I can't quite reach. Hmm. I can make a shot from here though. Move up. It's heals up to six. I'm not going to waste it. Um. I'll keep an eye out. That's reassuring. All right. Generator up. Great, I'm out. I think that's fine. I think you reload anyway. On the run. Go, go, go. Feel the fire covered. Not really worried. I'm pretty sure I can make it all the way there. I can't quite, but what I can do is do this. Smashing extremity. And now I can make it. Up we go. Woo! I have a feeling this is going to be one of the longer episodes. As you might imagine. The stragglers got a warning off to the 60th floor. The progeny knows you're here. Let him tremble. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so we have main door, side window, side window. First unit will be rooted. Successful shot stun. Interesting. Running gun on first turn. Plus 25 defense. I mean, running gun is useful. Not that useful for any of my guys, though, to be perfectly honest. Um, so I think we do everything. First unit 3 gets rooted. Gotta be talk. Zephyr... I think I saved the flash bomb. And blue blood terminal. I think I save refresh as well. Actually, no, we don't save that though because we have a ceasefire on terminal. Ooh, that's interesting. Okay, so do do the refresh. Hmm. Terminal through, do ceasefire, then Zephyr through here. Um, I'm just thinking for next turn, so I can th throw flash bomb on her and heal next turn. Move in now. Grenade out. Fantastic. Alert! Alert! Aggressive thrall, which I can probably take out. Yeah, take the shot. Perfect. Not a good shot on that codex. I think instead, see if we can take out a thrall. Lance's shot on this guy there. Not horrible. Uh, stun, so I don't have to worry about it. Advance on. 
the thrall, take it out. That was a circuitous route to get there, but okay. Glad you're on our side. Okay, so they have psionic shielding. Because of that, I guess. The torch soon passes. Will you accept the flame, or shall it consume you? Oh, she's here. Fuck. I thought there wasn't. This only encounter two. That's intriguing to me. Um. Okay, so you're rooted. Can't really tongue pull anyone either, so just take a shot at something. Pylon. Or the Archon. I think we need to take out some pylons. Alright, first things first, kinetic screen on somebody. Probably her. Not a bad idea. Can't get that anywhere near as far as I wanted to get it. So I guess, yeah, just shoot the resonant pylon, I guess. Great turn. That's irritating. Not a whole lot I can do about it, but... Zephyr really can do the most damage here. Sure, take out the resonant. Smash the hostile. Parry, and now it's her go. Not bad. Melee attack, it's fine. Blood on my jacket? Ugh, again? <laughs> okay. Throwing grenade. She's immune to stun. Doesn't really surprise me. Um, seems like a waste, but...
Getting rid of that seems like a good idea. That was weird. Teleport animation didn't really work. I'm out again. That'll hurt. Eh, yeah, four. Points I'll take four. Down. Four's not too bad. Okay. I need to start doing some healing, probably, but let's do a reload and a shoot first, probably. Ready for anything. Chain shot on this guy, I'll take it. Hit the sec one, please. Damn. Three, oh, four, five. Okay, I think this is correct. Running the table. Guaranteed. Demolishing. Target down for good. You do good work. Smashing extremity. Fire, baby. Bounce off the armor. The goal is not to hit the armor. There's never enough ammo. Kill the sorcerer, please. It's not your day. All right, Violet's turn. Far less loving than me. Every pause is filled with notes. She doesn't seem like the real leader. Why am I fighting the leader on the second round? Um, okay. Safeguard here. He'll be fine. If you think it's best. Perfect. Take it. <laughs> you see that? Should have been my kill. This is yours. Stasis? No, it just didn't do enough damage. Interesting. It's fine. Should be able to take her out here. Still got it. All right, perfect. I'm surprised we took out Violet on the second to last rather than the last. Massive but. power readings ahead. Looks like they're trying to. Whoa. It just doubled. You need to shut down whatever they're powering up. This is interesting. Um, I want to surprise people if at all possible. So, Blue Blood, Zephyr, Terminal, heal everyone, please. Talk. Let's do it. Knock, knock. Open up the door, it's real. Take a medicine. <laughs> Two aggressives. Dead thrall. 
64 is not a good chance to hit, but it's better than 59, so take it. Fantastic. Take the shot. Shred the armor. I'm really surprised we took out, like, the big boss. Okay, shields. Fuck. So are we supposed to blow this thing up? Could I? It's the god shot, baby. Drop in the hammer. Ooh, that's six shields go on off everybody. <laughs> Where are they running to? We're supposed to blow this thing up. I think we're supposed to blow that thing up, but like, punch everybody. Fast as I can. I should read my objectives, really. Uh, yeah, parry, please. Um, okay. Prevent enemies from activating the psionic network. Right. And clearly... Okay, so I can just kill them. That's fine. <laughs> Not an issue. Just murder. That works perfectly. Uh, I get to here. Take that. Damn it. Could have killed him in one shot. I'm really not worried about side domain, to be honest. Hmm. Parrying a punch isn't as worth it, but... Slithering! I see you. Take that. You're dead. <laughs> Solid hit. I had worse. Hurt though. They heal on teleport, that's interesting. Um well you need to move, unfortunately. Because I don't necessarily want to get blown up by the by the dude. Take that though. Practice. Well, clearly, it was 83%. Ow. Another scar for my collection. Need me to take a look? Get rid of the thrall. Down for good. I have nice. Reaper back next turn, so I need to damage some dudes as much as possible. Now don't miss this time, please. Boom. 
Uh, second wind, please, Let's actually. Try that again. Mainly for Zephyr, to be perfectly honest. There we go. But it tops everyone else up as well, which is nice. Today. Next time, don't get hit. Covering ground. Hostel no longer exists. Damn. I think Deadeye is safer. I'll take it. Hang on. Fucking fly through the wall, cheaty bitch. <laughs> uh, I mean, he's the only one left, so just punch. Tougher than I expected. At least you didn't miss. Headed worm needed. Give it your all. Take that. Nice. Zephyr actually got wounded, not surprising. The progeny defeated. I've requested a cleanup team from XCOM HQ to dismantle that device. This felt like a close one. Head back to base and get some rest. <sighs> I'd say that was actually easier than the one I did previously, but I think that's just because all my guys are more powerful. Like the last investigation I did into the previous group um, was harder at the end, but I think that's just because my guys were nowhere near as powerful. Uh, Doctor, Violet, how are you today? Listen to how every pulse is filled with undernotes. Subject continues to be non-responsive, but becomes gloss <laughs> glossoli. Glossolalic. Glossololic. I don't- I literally have no idea what that means. Glossololic upon hearing her advent assigned name. Clear. Silver. Ice. Keen. Awakened tones. Recommended non-invasive psionic evaluation at first opportunity. Which pierce the sense and live within the soul. Subject Violet interview number 32, 2036, January 18. Interesting. So she was- in a mental asylum, seemingly. Great job, Chimera Squad. The progeny thought they could force a psionic evolution, but their tech was only capable of scrambling psionically sensitive minds for miles around. You stopped the progeny in their tracks and saved hundreds of lives. Nice. Investigation complete. Cool. Reclamation analyzed the intel from your latest investigation. We've noticed a troubling pattern. The progeny received external backing in building their psionic hmm. weapon. Atlas is no longer a theory. Now that we've foiled two of their plans, expect an escalation. Did you find a connection to Mayor Nightingale's death? Nothing. Focus your investigation on the remaining group of suspects and watch for any connections to Atlas. Interesting. Uh, yeah, so Sacred Coil was a lot harder. But, I think that's just because I was nowhere near as, um, souped up, as it were. So now we have Grey Phoenix, an organization of alien scavengers. They have quietly amassed this, their kind of weaponry. Reclamation is mandated to recover. Grey Phoenix has the funding to hire more mercenary muscle. Grey Phoenix ordnance has been calibrated for armor shredding impact. Good to know. Grey Phoenix is a group of primarily muton scavengers operating in the city. Recently, they've armed themselves with highly restricted weaponry. That puts them on our radar. Good to know. So I've, I've saved the mutons to last. That's never a good idea, but whatever. Um, an organization of alien scavengers. They have quietly amassed the kind of weaponry reclamation is marinated to cover. And this is the dark events. Okay. Apparently I have a critical mission that must be completed today. 
Uh, City Theory 1, unrest has become more serious. From now on, any ignored mission will add three unrest to its district. Any ignored situation will add two unrest to its district. Okay. Apparently this is critical. Um, let's reduce anarchy. Switchyard is full, unfortunately, but there's not a whole lot I can do about that. <clears throat> the plus side, my anarchy is down to nothing. Uh, so this is a mission we're going to go on next time, I guess. <laughs> Out of one story mission, straight into another one, I guess. But that's going to be it for this episode. If you like the video, please leave a like. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. And as always, thank you for watching, and I shall see you next time, where we're going to head into Grey Phoenix, I guess. See you guys.